Actually, Garrett, just coast it real quick. See what see what it does. I'm just coasting. Yeah. No coasting. shit. Do you think do you think we have enough time to like run up to the top while they can take the shots? I think we got enough time. Wait, let go, let go of it. See how straight it goes. Yeah, let's go quick. It goes quick. Straight. Go. 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 Get up there. Dude, this is going so perfect. It's literally just rolling straight up. Dude. Dude. Woo! Think no, I can touch it. this? I think you got it. You got it. Woo! Oh, shit. We need to get back in. We're going. Let's We're go going sideways. Go. It's going quicker. Give me the camera. Give me the camera. Go, 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 go. All right. I'll, I'll, I'll go, 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 that was so dope, dude. Hey everyone, welcome back to episode three of the Action Glow Bros vlog. And welcome aboard our school bus. Today, we're gonna be talking about our schoolie named Some of you may ask yourselves, why in the hell did the Action Glow Bros buy a school bus? Well, our school is going to play a huge role in marketing our new product, Action Glow 2. At the beginning of 2019, the Action Glow team is going to take our school bus around the country stopping at all of the mom and pop surf, skate, ski and bike shops coast to coast selling our new product, Action Glow 2. We'll be going back to the grassroots way of selling, following in the footsteps of the greats like Nick Woodman from GoPro and Jake Carpenter from Burton. But we're going to be the first to document this entire experience through a series we'll call Lead the Way. Now obviously the first thing we had to do was find a bus that would make it around the country. So we got on the horn and started calling all of the local bus garages to see if they had any retired buses that they were willing to sell us. Unfortunately, they didn't. But about a week later, we got an email from someone at the local Traverse City bus garage saying that there was a huge bus auction going on in a town about four and a half hours south of us. 21 now, 22. 22 would have been 22, would have been 22. I'm mean, going to 21 would have been 22. 22? After doing a lot of research, we realized that the best engines came in the 2002 International School Buses. So by the time we got to the auction, we already knew what we were looking for. Luckily, there were about eight of those buses at this auction. So we thought for sure we were leaving home with a school bus. But everyone must have been on the same page because these eight buses were selling for way more than we wanted to spend. So when we realized that one of the buses wasn't turning over, we saw an opportunity no one else did. Now keep in mind, we had no clue whether or not this bus actually worked. We figured it was just the batteries, it was the last one to go on auction, and we made an impulse decision to bid away. 22 divided by 22, would've been 22. Would've been 22, now 23. 23, now 24. 24 divided by 24, would've been 25. 26, get around 26. Would've been 26, now 27. 27 divided by 27, now 28. 28, 28, 29. 28, now 3,000. 3,000, cheap enough, 3,000. Would've been 3,000? Would've been 3,000? Would've been 3,000? Sold. Sold them, 2,900, better number. Yes! 733. <laughs> and sure enough, sold to the Action Glow Brothers. And you guys know Garrett and I. Obviously, we made friends with all the other bidders at the auction. So we asked a few guys that bought buses that didn't work if we could just switch batteries and see if we can get our bus started. They had no problem helping us out. So we swapped the batteries, and when we grabbed the key to bus 5002 and tried to turn her over, yes! the bus started right up. And we drove that baby all the way home with no experience behind the wheel at all. Woo! 
The conversion started that night. As soon as we got this baby home and backed her down the driveway, we busted out the angle grinder and started ripping out the seats and laid out a blueprint. And for those of you that are interested, we plan on uploading videos that will be part of a separate series focusing on the bus conversion alone. Now, if you follow us on Instagram, we gave you guys a chance to name our school bus through a poll. The poll was between Baloo, the name that I came up with, or Sid, the name Garrett came up with. And we had plenty of time to think about who we actually wanted to win. Uh, and we realized we hated both of those names. They're just not clever. They were not clever. However, during our poll, we had one person shout out a super clever name. They came up with the name, the Transporter because the bus will be transporting us around the country and their last name's Porter, so it made a lot more sense. So, our schoolie's name is now The, the Transporter! Transporter. <laughs> what? That wraps it up for episode three of the Action Glow Bros vlog. Smash that subscribe button to keep up with our journey around the country and everything else we've been doing. Hit the like button because that helps us out a lot and hopefully we'll see you in episode four. Good, good. Yes!